So here's a way to lock your friend out of every single one of their apps so they can't click on them and can't get into any single program on their iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad. Okay, here's what you wanna do. First things first, you wanna make sure that you're on the person's first screen, their home screen. That's the screen right next to their search menu. So scroll all the way to the right till you get the search and then go one back and you are on their home screen. Then hold down the home button and then press the power button to take a screenshot. Now what you're going to do is hold down any icon to make them start to jiggle. Look at, they're jiggling. They're doing a little dance. Okay, enough of that. So now what you're going to do is you're going to take their icons and you're going to start to move them to a different screen. Um, if you want to be really vindictive, you can move them all the way to their last screen. But really just move them over and this is going to take some time, but promise you it's well worth it. Now the only icon left should be this top left one because that one's not going to be able to be moved and these bottom four. All you do is press the home button so they stop jiggling. And once they've stopped jiggling, you are now pretty much set. One more step. All you got to do is go back, find their photo app, open it, go to the camera roll, and find that picture that you just took before, that screenshot. This picture, no need to zoom, just take it hit use as wallpaper, set, you set as home screen. And now when they go back to their home screen, it's gonna look absolutely normal. Absolutely fine, like you never did anything. Turn off the phone and then just wait for the fun. Cause what's going to happen is they're gonna come back, turn on their phone, slide to unlock. And what they're going to do now is try and use one of their icons and it will not work. Now, what I thought was kind of lame about this is now when they scroll though through their apps, that background kind of just stays there. So I thought, oh, they'll be able to figure this out really quick. But I didn't realize that a lot of people don't know about the screen capture feature, that you can take a photo of your screen. So they had no idea that these were actually photos and they thought their phone was broken and that their apps just weren't moving. So if you want to be really vindictive so they can't even possibly figure it out, what you want to do is actually find their photo app one more time, go to the photo and delete it. So that way there's not a chance of it even being traced. And you can watch Christmas morning as your friends open up their new iPod Touch and after you've messed with it, them trying to click on apps that just will not work. I wonder how many people are going to the Genius Bar for this one.